then the, the special detail rates the same from town to town? The no, they vary because uh, keep in mind where we raise your rates. We live in a mixed area. Business, right? We live in a mixed area of, of uh, union shops and non-union shops. So one of the you know we utilize Seabrook a lot. They're right next door. They work with us. So I always try to give them first them and UNH first crack of the work. Now they have collective bargaining agreements with their particular entities, so it's governed by that. So if we work somewhere else, like if we go to Seabrook, we charge them based upon our rate. If Seabrook comes to Hampton and work, they charge based on their rate, and that's the agreement. Because if we try to get a Seabrook officer to accept the pay that Hampton has, it may be different than his contract. So yeah. to avoid any union conflicts amongst the agencies, we've just all agreed that Hampton charges Hampton rate, Seabrook charges Seabrook rate, and that way I don't get involved with any of the billing or any of the issues that if a Seabrook officer comes to Hampton. Uh, Seafood Fest paid, I believe, six different law enforcement agencies yeah. for the details to cover that three-day event. They all sent separate bills, Rockingham Sheriff, State Police, um, Seabrook, and any of the other agencies that work, they send a separate bill to the vendor, just like it happened in their town. It's just cleaner and easier because that would be impossible for finance to track that if we did it any other way.